Tell me about your, the computer you used when you were still living at home and in school. Because <laughs> I read about this on the weekend, and it's fascinating. Right. Well, so the, my initial love of computers came from um, the library at my school. So I grew up off of the grid. I did, my, my parents didn't have any electricity, and they were um, kind of getting back to land farming and, and doing all this stuff. So I had a well and chickens and goats and honeybees and when I grew up. Um, when I was uh, in school, I fell in love with the computers in the, in the library there, and uh, the librarian encouraged me to uh, learn how to program, and I got very involved. I was every recess, lunch, and after school playing on these computers. Um, there was a computer programming contest that was going on in, in the school district, and he, he gave me you know, a little bit of background. I started just getting obsessed in, into programming and entered into it, and the grand prize was an Apple IIc computer. It's a beautiful little computer at the time. It cost about $3,000. My allowance, I think, was a dollar a week, and so <laughs> it was like winning a Ferrari. So uh, I went into the contest, and I, I actually won the computer. Uh, so I had this great computer, but I had a problem. Uh, we didn't have any electricity, so uh, a it was it was a big problem. So um, my dad, being the great guy he is, he he took the computer to an electronic store, got it converted so that it would run off of uh, 12 volts. And every day after school, I'd come home, I'd pop the hood on my mom's car, get a couple of alligator clips, <laughs> stick the alligator <laughs> clips onto the car battery. And uh, I'd sit with my computer and a kerosene lamp beside me and, and play computer until I ran out my mom's car battery. She would give me hell the next day because the car battery would be dead and you'd have to jump start it. But uh, that was how I fell in love with computers. The Chief Executives, broadcasting live from the SFU BD School of Business on CKNW.